Welcome to Knock Bro Nation. Welcome back, guys. Hey, guys. Today we're here to do another Walking Dead video before the Season 8B premiere. Mm -hmm. This is actually a first look on the last eight episodes of Season 8 uh, and mainly has to do with the characters' strengths and weaknesses uh, during those eight episodes and the last stand with Negan. Yep, this is just a video they posted on AMC. It's uh, actually, uh, we'll be hearing from the cast and creators of The Walking Dead kind of talking about this. Um, I think we'll get to see some new scenes that we haven't seen that weren't in the trailer. They might show a couple scenes that could be in the trailer, but I think yep. there's some new ones in here. So we thought that it'd just be good to kind of show this and uh, kind of talk about it, give a breakdown of it. Yeah, we're going to talk. We're going to give a reaction to it. Yep. Biggest strength is their tenacity one by one. and their determination to win. They, do this now. they want to survive. They want to set themselves up to build a community where life can go on. That's the plan. I think the greatest oh, strength man. we have is solidarity. That must the have been three right communities the working as one. Even though they've managed to keep the saviors at bay. And so many of them are still alive. There is a bit of a sense of defeat. The biggest problem with our group is they let their emotions interfere with the plan. Their judgment gets clouded. Oh. You don't want to do this. I hope. Oh, I wonder that's when he breaks. Ultimately, Show! the fallout from the loss makes people do different things. I think the biggest weakness is the people that's when we he's are escaping. both forced yeah. to and decide to trust. Ooh, and that's going to be Morgan tested. When you're fighting this war, you're driven Ooh, so much by white. rage. Yes, and wall. it's hard to let that rage carry you as long as it Ooh, needs to carry you. I made a choice I could move on. Each person feels different about what this battle has meant to them. They're in no way willing to back down, but they're recognizing by the time it's over, they may lose a lot more Garrett. than they anticipated. That's when they get when we reveal Carl's dies bit, right there. That really is a defining moment that redirects Rick. Whoa. Yeah. Redirects Rick. Mm hmm. Um, redirects him. Yeah. <laughs> um, it was Morgan heavy, really Morgan heavy. Yeah, so they showed that shot where he he was drawing the line in the sand. And I, I'm just wondering what that's going to be symbolizing. Like if he's, I don't know if he's talking with saviors and he's drawing a line in the sand. Like if he's symbolizing him breaking, because we saw that scene with him and Carol. And Carol's like, you don't have to do this. And he's almost to tears saying, I, I have to. And I'm just wondering if that's the part where he's breaking to where he leaves the group, you know, where he's going to be going to fear. But I just something... expected it to happen after the war. Like, I expect him to be a part of the major battle at the hilltop. Yeah, we don't know when these scenes are in. Exactly. You know, but, that, but that whole scene with Morgan and Carol, the shading, the they're outside. That, that looks like it's part of the it war. Looks like, no, that looks like it happens when they break King Ezekiel out. Probably, yeah. And then there's another part of Carol and Morgan when they're like on the outskirts of something. Like mm -hmm. they're not like they're saying like when he's like we can take them all yeah. one by one or yeah. whatever. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. It the the biggest thing I the one of the biggest things I took from that is just that line in the sand. I'm, I'm wondering what that's going to be symbolizing Morgan drawing a line in the sand. So on something. This this last 8 episodes is the center of it all is Carl's death. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's clearly the the center of it all. Just like, like what they said, like yeah. their emotions are, are are running too high, and they're making bad decisions because of their emotions. Um, but what was the end again about it? Uh, about Rick, yeah, the, it, the loss. It changes his path. Right, it like, changes it, his path, his yeah. direction. It redirects yeah. him. Redirects Rick from from the loss. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So good. Like, that, that was really good. Yeah, I mean, it was really good. I there were little clips of scenes, like uh, the moment when Michonne pushed 
Dwight. Dwight. Mm-hmm. When we they're hadn't in the, when seen they're, that before. Yeah, when they're in the sewer. Um, there was that moment where Daryl confronts Rick, you know, briefly. Right. And that must be after he finds out that he know he knows that Rick knows about Carl. Right. So because he's holding Judith. Yeah. And just kind of saying, you know, here for you in a sense, you yeah. know. But yeah, uh, that was really cool. I mean, I, I liked that a lot. I love the music behind it too. It was just like building and yeah. building and like yeah. getting I mean, pumped for war. It's it's going to be a crazy war, and yeah, I just, uh, I'm ready. I'm ready for next weekend. I am ready. <laughs> yeah, so uh, we'll be doing uh, probably probably next week, next Thursday um, when we record. So it'll probably come out next Friday. Um, we'll be our overall predictions of the the rest of uh, season eight B. So um we can't it wait might for be the... a lot of rehashing but we yeah, like to yeah. have one more video out there before the premiere before the Sunday. premiere and then we'll be getting doing our reviews yep can't wait for that guys so hope you enjoyed that um as we said check we'll put the link in the description but check that on Am- uh, amc.com i always want to say amazon <laughs> <laughs> amc.com um that was a really cool first look at that stuff yeah so. cool so let us know your thoughts and we'll see you on the next one we're not Nation. we're, we're out, out.